Okay, here's a quick tutorial on how to change the visual uh, theme on XP. As you can see, mine's not the normal XP that you get. It's completely changed. It's uh, more of a Media Center 2005 taskbar, and the Windows start is completely different. Yeah, as you can see, the log off and stuff. Um, what you want to do is you want to download something called XPIs. So let's bring that into view for you. Uh, it's just XPIs like that go into the website uh, and download it. Uh, all it does is it basically tells Windows to accept themes and it uh, makes it, puts it into the registry so it remembers it but it doesn't mean doesn't do anything horrible like um, I know a lot of people have uh, used programs which um, install themselves and are fine like I think the people that run them are like object doc like object looks okay but um there's something else they make and it what it does that's a fine program but when you go to install the actual themes it starts installing crap to internet explorer so when you search it loads a pop up and all stuff is put into your computer but this is complete the safe way so what all that does is it tells to accept themes and then you go to deviant art themes and then yep then what you'll need to do is go to visual styles uh and search up here XP basically unless you have Vista or something I don't know but XP and scroll down to find something so you can make it look like a, a sort of Vista or you can make it look like Ubuntu Mac everything really It'll, you can also change the login uh, styles and also um, your I, uh, cursor as you can see my cursor isn't the normal one it, it actually uses the Mac some Mac Apple Mac uh, loading and stuff like that. Um, but go down, I don't know. Let's choose the Vista VG Black for Windows XP. So, it kind of looks like a business effect, really. Uh, go to download. It's a RAW file, so you may need WinRAR or 7zip, whatever you use. Uh, unzip it. Um, so, once you've installed XPIs and you've got and you've unzipped the, um, the visual theme that you want you need to take the folder go to start my computer uh, C or E whichever one your Windows folders in so mine's in E Windows resources so from here look you can put if you find cursors you can put cursors in there um, screen savers icons etc okay. we're going to themes and I don't know say you downloaded SAN XP2 uh, you take the folder from your desktop and drag it into here double click on it and you'll look for something that says visual style file double click on that and this is basically what it will look like, it will start showing you it they usually come with a few different fonts so that's a bit more smaller and stuff anyway uh, what you do then is you apply it and as you can see now click X from that and now what you can see is it's completely changed it there's quite a few if we go back I also have um, uh, OSX Tiger and stuff uh, but all I was going to show you was um, Vista you can actually make it into an error theme it changes the start menu and everything but I like this one because it just looks nice and neat really um, so if you want that one guys that is called Lunar Element so that's Lunar Element yeah that's the version 5 um, I hope this has helped you guys go into the description area go to our website and go to the forums if there's any problems you know sign up and talk on there also give us some uh, feedback on what you think of the videos and also if you could just tell us if you want a video I don't know on how to install barrel on Linux or something like that, you know, something unusual that you don't really understand and we can try and find it for you and give you the best option on how to install things or how to uninstall problems, anything. We'll we'll find out for you guys there. So that's so that's uh, all from me. Um I hope this helped you guys on how to change your visual theme on XP.